Hi, this is John Park, and today we have another self-directed IRA and 401k question for everyone. One of the questions that I got from a gentleman last week who called me, and he was talking about doing either a transfer with an IRA or a 401k rollover into a self-directed IRA or a 401k is, is this a taxable event? Obviously, all of us who have retirement assets and we're taking it from one plan to another want to ensure that we're not creating a taxable event in the eyes of the IRS where, you know, in a worst case, worst case scenario, our plan, I use really technical language here, folks, is like blown up where the distribution or that the transfer or the rollover that you're doing, you feel may be a distribution and, can, and therefore is considered a taxable event. Absolutely not as long as it's structured correctly. When you transfer money from an old IRA or an old 401k account into a new self-directed IRA or a 401k, it is actually going from one custodial arrangement to another custodial arrangement. That is not considered a distribution. It is not a taxable event. There are no taxes to be paid on that. There are no penalties to be paid on that. So as you're exploring the world of self-direction, if this is something that interests you, just keep that in mind from an educational standpoint. You can transfer your old IRA. You can roll over your old 401k into self-directed status. And as long as it's structured correctly, no taxable event, no taxes, no penalties. With that, I hope you found this uh, video to be educational and informative. If you liked it, go to the link on this page to see more videos related to questions pertaining to self-directed IRAs and 401ks. And as always, thank you for your time and best of luck with your wealth building strategies this year.